God, oh God. Boy, boy. Hey there, guys. This is Phone Tech Kid, and today I'm going to be going over Paranoid Android ROM for your Nexus 10. So right off the bat, this is for your Nexus 10, and subscribe because I will be making more ROM reviews now for the Nexus 10. As you can see, you have kind of a more of a tablet UI. Your notification center is down here at the bottom. If we go and enter settings, you can go down to about tablet. You can see that it is 2.99.9 pi paranoid Android version. We can also go into hybrid properties. That is where you could change between tablet UI small, tablet UI big. The cool thing is you don't even need to reboot anymore. So if I show you tablet UI small and click apply, we'll just take it away and apply it and see. Smaller now. So are these buttons. Some other settings you do get there. Um, if you go into toolbars, you get to manage this right here, and you could also uh, you also get this thing called Pi, which I'll be showing later. And you could also customize your quick setting tiles. Go over here and down into tiles and layout. You can see you can customize, add, or take away anything. You could also customize your lock screen, and then you get themes. So what Pi is, which just came in the new update last night, and I flashed it. You hold down the power button. And you click expand desktop, it takes away the bottom row, right? Where the buttons are. And so this was in the last update too, but there was no way you could get the buttons back unless you press the power button. So now you get to choose where you want this to pop up. I chose the bottom, and here it is. Pretty cool, huh? So you get all your buttons here. If you want to let go of them, let go. And then you could kill that or open it up. And it works in any app. So let's say I want to go home. It takes me home. So it even shows if you look at the top. If you have any new notifications. The battery life. And you also get the time right there. So it's pretty goddamn awesome. And I don't think any other ROM has that yet. And that might be the main reason why I would stick with this ROM. So, really, go check this ROM out. It's Paranoid Android. I'm pretty sure you're aware with it. There's no bugs with it right now. I have actually had less random reboots with this ROM than I had with stock. I've had none with this. And with stock, I got about two a day. So, it's a really fast ROM. Really nice. And I suggest going and trying it out. So please subscribe for more videos like this as I will be making more ROM reviews for the Nexus 10, the Galaxy S3, and the Nexus 7. So thanks for watching. God, oh God. Boy, boy. I've been working all God.